Hello everybody, this is Alan Peterson with linkcloakingguide.com and for this video I'm going to show you how I cloak my affiliate links for Commission Junction. This is a question that I get a lot on my on my blog and also I see a lot on the forums. Uh, people uh, aren't sure if they can cloak their uh, Commission Junction Commission Junction um, affiliate links, and not only Commission Junction, but all the other affiliate programs out there like ShareLink or, or LinkShare, for example. So I'm going to go ahead and show you how I do it with uh, with CJ. Now I'm not a huge uh, CJ affiliate, affiliate. I'll be honest about that, but I do I do get paid by them, and I and my checks are small. They probably average about a, you know 100 and some dollars uh, per check from Commission Junction, but I do get paid, and I haven't had any issues uh, cloaking my links for Commission Junction because I cloak all my affiliate links so we are so here we are at the CJ account manager and I've pulled up GoDaddy and I'm gonna go ahead and grab a link and show you how it is that I cloak it all right let me uh, what you want to do is you want to go all the way across to the right and on the, the get links column here's what you're gonna where you're gonna get the uh, affiliate link to cloak and so let's get a nice uh, low uh, a nice uh, link here uh, hosting I wouldn't recommend hosting GoDaddy hosting on anybody <laughs> but domain registrations they're pretty good so let's see here here we go GoDaddy domains here's a good one so what you want to do you have the options of get the JavaScript or get HTML uh, you want to click on the get HTML link okay so this pops up and so you just uh, get the information you need let me just uh, move this down a little bit so you can see the code and here is the code and this is the code that we need this is the uh, the code that the Commission Junction generates and this is why a lot of people get confused because they see all this stuff here and they're like well what do I do so now basically this what this code does it creates the uh, uh, banner that you can see up here with your affiliate link embedded and so that's what this code is all about you copy and paste this code paste it into your HTML uh, editor and then this this button here will appear on this banner here will appear on your website and the image screen it does serve a purpose where it, it, it uh, tracks click through click through rates on the uh, image link but you don't really need that if you're just going to be uh, referring somebody from your blog or in an ebook and you just want the, the link code that's all you need is your affiliate link if you use a software program um, like or a script like I use a simple link manager or there's other ones like affiliate shield or uh, power link generator these are all work the same way and so basically what you want to do is you want to grab the link which is located in the href tags and it's between the two quotation marks here so you'll see it right here this is what you need so just go ahead and highlight that, copy it, and then what I just do, I paste it into a notepad, a blank notepad like this. Go ahead and paste that in there, and here we go. This is our link. This is what we need. Let's uh, take it for a test drive to make sure it works. Make sure we did it right. So there's the link that I got that I pasted into notepad. Let's go ahead and hit enter and a GoDaddy page uh, should load here in a second or two and here we go there you have GoDaddy and so now basically anybody that was to search for domains through that link of mine through my cloaked link and were to buy I would get a commission and I would be paid by GoDaddy alright so the affiliate link is working and so let's go ahead and cloak it so you just uh, log into my simple link manager plugin click on add a link and it's just uh, follow the uh, the prompts here the link name is going to be GoDaddy not GoDaddy uh, there it is link alias uh, must be unique with no spaces so let's call this uh, oh, here's one that I've already used before GoDaddy domains I like that because it's nice and search engine friendly uh, text there and then the destination URL, of course, is my Go is my uh, GoDaddy affiliate link, which I got from CJ Jenks, uh, CJ. So there we go. So those are the three things that I need. So we just go ahead and click on Add Link, and then there you have it. It's been cloaked. And so now my new URL that I'll be using is www.imnirvana.com forward slash recommends forward slash GoDaddy domains compare that to the CJ generated link 
uh, uh, which is all this stuff. <laughs> blah 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 blah. As you can see, the uh, nice clean link is a lot nicer than than the actual CJ link. So let's go ahead and test that link, the cloaked link. Um, oops, that's the wrong one. Hold on a sec. Ah, there we go. Much better. I am Nirvana.com recommends GoDaddy domains. Let's click on that, and you'll see that the GoDaddy web page website will up will load here in a second. And there we go. Anybody that purchases via this link will I will get a commission. So here is that uh, that link that I set up. As you can see, at GoDaddy GoDaddy domains is the name that I gave it. And then the, here it shows you the actual affiliate link, and it shows you the clean URL. And uh, let me just move this over here a little bit to the right. As you can see, it provides you the uh, stats on the clicks. And uh, that is done in real time. I'm just loading the uh, domain again using my uh, cloaked link just to show you. Okay, that worked fine. And now let's go back here. Let's hit refresh. And yeah, that's okay because there's some security there. And you'll see the clicks will now be two instead of one as soon as the uh, page stops loading. And there we go. So it's real time stats, which is very nice. So there you have it. That's how I cloak all my, my links, uh, regardless whether it is ClickBank, CJ, ShareLink, Link, uh, LinkShare, whatever. It doesn't uh, share a sale. I'm sorry, share a sale. L LinkShare, kind of combining all these together. It doesn't matter what affiliate program is. I also uh, promote a, a few uh, affiliates that are self-hosted by uh, by the actual uh, merchant. And I cloaked those links too, and I never had a problem. Now, with uh, CJ or with any affiliate program, if you if you have a question, if you really want to make sure you're not violating any rules, um, you can contact them even via even even via CJ. Don't go through CJ because their customer service stinks. But any any affiliate program that's running through uh, Commission Junction will usually all of them have their own affiliate program managers, and you can email them and ask them, you know, what what do you allow? I want to cloak my links, you know, and most of them uh, shouldn't have any problems. I know that uh, the uh, uh, hard cloaking uh, using frames and things like that, um, which is which is black hat isn't allowed but if you're doing what I just showed you here which is a simple redirection you should be able to uh, to be uh, to be okay I've received my my checks and I never had any problems I never had anyone contact me uh, telling me not to do that and so you shouldn't have any issues either and so that's it I just wanted to show you how I cloak my Commission Junction affiliate links for more information on link cloaking uh, you can visit my site at linkcloakingguide.com thank you bye